Hey guys, Hydra Warrior here, and today I'm just going to do a fluff reading and tell you why I chose the High Fleet Hydra narrative and their paint scheme. So without further ado, let's get into it. Hydra. A minor Tyranid High Fleet awoken prematurely from an eons long hibernation and is now advancing into the galaxy to slake its hunger. It was encountered on the very extremes of the Eastern Spiral and the Galactic South. The Dark Eldar and the Cabal of the Poison Fang were the first to encounter the still dormant High Fleet and it had an intent of capturing their new victims. They boarded the Hive ship and were very quickly overwhelmed and butchered by the extreme rate of the Tyranid creatures awoken to protect their ship. That is all the fluff I know of on High Fleet Hydra. Now, reading that fluff has given me the, the narrative that every model I paint is a new, a new creature that has awoken from High Fleet Hydra to protect and devour, which is which is pretty cool. I, I kind of like that. So, I mean, like. Right now, I've only got a couple of models that have been painted and it fits with that bit of fluff quite nicely. Um, with the paint scheme, the whole idea around the green literally comes from the name Hydra. Because the name Hydra says poison to me and poison to me says green. So, as simple as it is, I went with green. The rest is history. Like, uh, so, but um, let me know if, you, if I've missed anything on High Fleet Hydra. I mean, if I've missed any bits of fluff, if there's any stories, any, any battle stories with them, other than what I've just read, please let me know. I'd be very interested into hearing it. But, uh, yeah, that's, that's why I picked High Fleet Hydra. And um, I'll see you next time.